What is going on with you? Come on, explain yourself. You've insulted Isabel, you've embarrassed me. Why wouldn't you come and discuss things with me instead of running around shooting your mouth off like that? And how do you think it makes me feel knowing that's your opinion of me? I'm some sort of what? A lying cheat who would just stray the second I got a chance. What do you reckon? I did come to you and you lied to my face. This morning I asked you where you were last night and you spun me some story about being out with a work colleague. I'm sorry, but from what I saw, you weren't exactly discussing medical OK, jobs. let just... Just let me say for the record here, I'm absolutely furious that you would spy on me like that. Why wouldn't you just come and discuss it like an adult? Well, I'm glad I did, otherwise I might not have found what's been going on. Yeah, but there is nothing going on between Isabel and myself. Malcolm, for heaven's sake, no matter what you saw or you, or you think you saw, we are not having an affair. End of story. Oh, come I, I am a grown man, Malcolm, as are you. I would have thought you'd know that the, besides black and white, there are shades of grey. Oh, what shade is Izzy? Oh, this is just ridiculous. You want me to behave like an adult? I'm not the one running around and my wife behaving like some overgrown teenager <laughs> while she's sitting over in Adelaide trying to figure out why her marriage is falling apart. What has she said to you? Don't worry, she didn't say anything. She kept up with your story about some terminally ill patient or whatever it is that you were trying to spin me. It's a load of crap. No, I knew something was wrong with Mum from the moment I saw her. Your mother and I are, um, are experiencing some problems at the moment, yes. Yeah, well, that's pretty obvious. I came over here to see for myself what's been going on, and I'm glad I did. So you can stick to your story of you and Izzy just being friends. But I don't think Mum will be able to cope with that. I can't hang around here. I've booked a ticket back to London. I'll be out of your hair by lunchtime. Do what you want. <laughs>